Welcome to the next stop on the tour. This is the Jerome Gas Thula Swan House. Now I've done some deed work on this house to determine the year of construction. It is considered to be federal style construction and sure enough in 1820 I find the earliest deed with some value on it to a John Hill and so I believe that the first building on the property was built by John Hill. Now we have what it looks like two different architectural styles going on. The back L seems to be of an older construction, so that may be what John Hill constructed. The front part appears to be a little bit newer. It's got the pilasters on it. It's also got uh, the kind of a Greek revival style going on with the gable uh, roof ends on it. Uh, this uh, building also has a Victorian porch that's been added on late, later. So it's got a combination of styles, but we're going to call it Federal 1820s. One more interesting fact about this house is after the Civil War, a brigadier, a Union Brigadier General by the name of Joel Allen Dewey lived in this house. And Joel Allen Dewey is buried uh, over in the Hopewell, the old Hopewell Cemetery. And the Civil War buffs come to look at the uh, gravesite of that Union General pretty often. 